hell. It's taking forever to get upstairs. We literally walked 20 feet. No, come in. Come in, come in. Uh, 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 uh. All right, whoever's in the store, y'all all get free shoes. No, no, bro, no, stop! No, 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 at it again guys you already know what time it is you know when you see me standing in this store that probably means we got a special guest with us the one and only ryan garcia let's get to thank it you for having me. Hey. Thank you. oh the top is fly too <laughs> oh, ours was <laughs> chill, chill, chill. so right off the rip you came in with the travis these are mine i bought them for my god chance okay <laughs> yeah, i want to get some of my own though so as an everyday shoe, like is that the type of stuff that you rock? Or being an athlete, do you care more about comfort? What is it? What, just, what kind of shoe you rock and vibe is going on. So it doesn't matter. Whatever's I, working with if the I fit. Wear, I, bro, I make Hoka's look fine. <laughs> That's kind of what I was getting at. I didn't bro, know if it, it don't matter what you like. Or, yeah. If it look good, it look good. I don't yeah. give a fuck what it is. See, that's you know that's what people got to confuse these days is they like to follow what's cool yeah. instead of just being themselves. So yep. the fact that you are yourself, Amazing. What size shoe are you? Nine and a half, ten. Nine and a half, ten. ten. Man, I could even fuck around and be a nine, but it just could be. <laughs> nine and a half, ten. Those SPs nine, nine and a half, and ten. To them, nine, so we'll start with like a nine and a half. Perfect. Meet in the middle. So what about inside the ring? Do you have a preference on a boxing shoe that yeah, you prefer Nike, to wear? Nike Hyper KOs. Nike Hyper KO. All right. Oh, perfect. Now, was that, has that always been a thing, or was there a certain scenario in a fight that you wore them, and you're like, okay, like this no, is I the mean, shoe. I, I've been using them since I was a kid. You know, Manny Pacquiao had his own line with Nike. Sure. That inspired me to use them, and then they were really good. Um, but then, obviously, Manny Pacquiao messed up and said some crazy shit, and then they took them off. Yeah. And then, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> but, you know, I didn't want to get into good shot. I feel, like, I love I feel like talking crazy shit when it comes to <laughs> boxing. Like, talking crazy shit, first of all, the number one sport is boxing. Yeah. Right. So it's part of the, it's part of the, well, you know, I mean, how you when you get hit in the head and you're risking your life for a line, it really don't matter what the fuck you say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I really don't give a fuck. How are you, <laughs> how are you liking Dallas so far? It's the best place ever. Peaceful, business oriented, people mind their business. And we get to it. So, we, Errol has been with us for, since day one in here. Frank been rocking with us. Look, we've actually so done episodes like with, both, with them, both of them. Andrew yeah. Bonta and Devin oh, Hayes. So we've done something. Fuck them both. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering what the, what the response yeah, what's was going to be with those names. Play some music, bro. Some music. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yo, yeah, Jordan, you want to show him exactly what you might have available, and then he can pick some stuff out for himself? Damn, there's so many. I might spend a lot. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Ooh. Jordan one low diamond short. A lot of the guys, your peers in this sport, are coming out with these shoe surgeon custom boxing shoes. Do you have any thoughts on that? Is that you don't even care about that? No, I'm put, not a custom. Put some guy fucking either. boots on. I'm ready to and fuck lace you them up. up and let's go. I like that. I ain't worried I like about that. no custom. I'm worried about beating your ass. <laughs> fuck a custom. I like that. I'll custom like that. beat your ass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means. That's funny. You can tell I'm picky. Nah, take your time, man. There's a lot to go through in here, and I know sometimes it could be a little overwhelming. That's a good, overwhelming. That's a good size foot, too, though. So, size is me, But so. yeah, we yeah. should have most of the stuff that you're... Yo, that, good that size foot is crazy to say, bro. <laughs> it is, though. <laughs> I swear. Like a, no, really. If you're in here with a 12 or 13, you're out of there. You got 12, though? Well, I'm talking about some of these shoes. But yeah. He's a size 12. Yeah, we do. Yeah. He's gonna have a lot less. But I can, I can tell you do wear a lot of sneakers because you're like me, one half size down and one half size up. You don't wear either. Oh, these are crazy. Burgundies. Burgundies. I know, I don't usually wear red. Those are the Valentine's. The only time ones. I wear red if it's like blood red. Yeah. That was the Valentine's drop. Facts. What's that blood red? Blood red for real. This is what they look like in person. This is the Valentine's release. Oh, yes. Mm, yes. All suede on the inner, like velvet on the inside. These look he dope. I just don't like the little. Got this cool little handy other one that they touch, the touch tips. Whoa, bro! Oh, <laughs> hey, bro! Like, like actually, oh, bro, 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 bro. first of all, shoe bro. size. Yeah, man. If you're not training, if you're not boxing, what other kind of stuff are you doing? Everything. Like, are you an out guy? Like an outdoor, like adventure, uh, every type. Like, just do whatever. I saw you at John Reed yesterday. That's where I work out. Oh yeah, John. The gym. You like that gym? 
Yeah, Aesthetically, it's nice, but as bro, far as like amenities, I mean, there's no amenities there, no sauna. No I can say a lot like for why I like that gym. You know sure. why I like that gym. Why do you think I got a membership there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know damn well y'all, why I like that Y'all go in there for the same reason. <laughs> yeah. well, that's the only way to go. Oh, man. Oh, hey, shout out John Reed. <laughs> I got a whole room dedicated to squats. That's where I hang out most of the time. Mac City, baby. <laughs> exactly. You don't need money by that good. <laughs> this is insane, bro. Thank you so much. Thank you. Y'all find a pair or no? Not yet, not yet. Man, hey, let's go find some help. <laughs> <Yes. laughs> what y'all like? I like, uh, I like off white. Off white dunks. Go over here. That's off white, right? Am I yeah, 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 that's off white. I was also looking at some ones. I don't know. Just find some. Sir, yes, sir. Don't go too crazy, man. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Ryan, do you have a particular fight that stands out to you and you were like, okay, I made it. Like, this is the one that that, that brought fight. you to the... I mean, you got to be Campbell. Not Campbell, yeah. yeah. During COVID time. Yeah, yeah. Like, my first big test. Yeah. He was the Olympic gold medalist. Everybody knows was going to get lost. I get dropped and I come back and knock him out. Yep, that was the, one of the, the best side. comebacks. Right, that was sick. Man. Period. I mean, so that moment I knew like, I got it like yeah. that. Yeah, obviously your heart was put out there with that one. Everybody got to see like how you really get down right. that you could I mean, a lot of shit happened after so. that, but, yeah, but that know. moment was great though. Yeah, well, yeah, cause I, now everybody wants to come for you. Exactly. So, yeah, and you then have it's no just like. But to, to act the way that you have to. Exactly. Tough, so. What about a day of training? Are you training like, like Give me a time frame. I like train eight so hours hard. A day, people like... cry when I train. I know that's crazy. What do you mean? <laughs> people you're training with, or what do you mean? Oh, by? I train so hard. They'd be like, "Damn, I'm gonna cry." This motherfucker really goes hard. Wow. That's a fight. Okay. Oh, that's that's not even a oh, yeah. okay. He, okay. He didn't cry, but I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I definitely. Yeah, but I witnessed it. <laughs> yeah. I, I go crazy. With and obviously, being at the Derek James camp, like yeah. that's a. That was my next question. Derek I was just, wondering why you. Derek just texted me oh, the other day. He was like. Cause somebody said the most disciplined fighter versus the most undisciplined fighter, and you, you mess with like they don't even know you. Yeah, yeah. And you don't like you don't get to the spot not being disciplined. Correct. You know what I'm saying. Correct. And some things don't even need to be said. Yeah. So obviously moving to Dallas was a strategical thing that you thought, yeah, or yeah, is yeah. it just you needed a change well, after the well, last fight? We go back to Campbell. I'm looking outside. It's obviously in Dallas. I feel like my heart, my spirit. God says move here. Three that years later, it happens. God did. God did. And God will. Ballpark for the kids. Ballpark price. I would say less. Nothing over a thousand. Nothing over a thousand. I didn't say like three below. Oh shit. Are they all still in the room? <laughs> We've had a lot of people in here. We've done a lot of these episodes, and that's by far the coolest thing that anyone's ever done that we've had. So if that if that sets a bar, then you're way you up here. And if somebody uh, sees the bar, I'm gonna go come back and go crazy. <laughs> we'll go back and forth. Huh? All right. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get y'all shoes. Are you for real? Whatever shoe you want. Can really? we take a picture with you? I feel bad. Y'all too, though. <laughs> After, okay. Y'all too, and that's it. Oh, my God. <laughs> but keep it, like, low-key, like, you know, like, Okay. <laughs> so one of the hottest brands right now that we carry is gonna be Hellstar. I will never buy anything. So hear me out. No, no, no. Hear me out, though. No, 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 no. You guys have. To, oh, you gotta hear me out. Uh, should we hear him? Oh man, where's that? Where's that interview? Where's, where's that interview? He He's the same as you. Like what you're thinking. All I talk. Is exactly all I do on my social media platforms. I, I preach about God. I give away WWE. So you felt that already. So, man, I gotta find an interview. So the guy's a uh, preacher's son. Make it makes sense. Yeah, I got you. One second. Let me pause it. Gene's kind of like a shock value a little bit, you know? Yeah. It I is. Guess the message behind it is, like, a lot of times Earth can feel like hell, you know? You live in, like, a hell on Earth. And I know God always talked about how, like, Earth was for Satan to, rule, to like, you know, rule over and all of that. There's so no that's kind of how that, I see it. So when I was, you know, growing up, there was that song in church, like, this little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. So just talk about shining and do all the bad, do all the, all, you know, all the, all the, all the dark times. Just keep shining, you know, and, and like Jesus is a great example of that. So that's like the biggest grace for me because I grew up, you know, in the church. My parents are pastors, and so there's a lot, there's a lot of spirituality in the yeah, brand. Yeah. So I don't like telling too much because I want people to kind of, you know, explore. Yeah, yeah some sure. people look at it and they'll be like, mm. oh hell, like you know, it's like Ted, but I feel like we gotta take that like stigma away from it. Like it's just as real as heaven, you know. Got it. <laughs> 
I mean, we're not scared. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a respect, you know, for God. But I mean, I get, I get what he's saying. What about you? You ain't got no shoes? Yeah, it's a few. It's a few on there, I might have seen. All right, so, so basically, like, how you're very vocal about, like, your religion? Yeah. So no, I, no, I no, 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 no. Not religion. I follow Christ. God. Okay, excuse me. No, okay. no, no. Break no. it down to me real quick. Religion what, is a practice. It. Okay. So it's a man-made thing to have control. But I believe I follow Christ. I have a personal relationship with Christ. Right. So for me, I'm spirit-led. Religion is a whole different thing. Okay. You got rules, regulations. For sure. If you don't do this, this, and that, you're going to hell. Or if you don't do this, this, and that, nothing. So when I go, wherever Jesus taught, I'm about it. Whatever Jesus leads me, I'm with it. But religion is a whole different. Then you're going, then you're putting me in a box. I'm not a box. I'm, I'm, God is not a box. God can do anything. So for me, I follow Christ. I'm a follower of Christ. I serve Christ, and I let His will be done, not mine. That's it. So. To add to that, people always ask me questions about the same thing, and I try to explain to them that I don't typically go to a church. I have church wherever I'm at with, with my relationship with the Lord. So 100%. I had a questionnaire for the first time on my social media, and someone's like, moments of self-doubt, what helps you regain confidence? I said, prayer more than anything. Talk to God daily, like it's an actual conversation yes. in private. I typically do this in the shower, car, Anywhere, work, right? in bed. God wants to always be involved in your life, and it can be tough at times because the devil has control of everything that is worldly on this earth. And those things can typically distract us and most of the time move us astray from him. Mm -hmm. But if you praise him for the good as well as the bad, and on the daily of your life, the more that you are in tune with him, the y'all's relationship is, the more powerful your prayers will be. And in return, he'll in return he'll help you with confidence and obstacles to overcome right. anything. Daily. I respect that. And so I'm the same exact way. Yeah, really solid. So that's why when you said that, I was like, damn, I already know that he doesn't. You already felt it. <laughs> off right the rib, immediately, I was like, But I, you didn't know the meaning behind it, so I had to pull I caught it quick, though, quick. So, yes, 1,000%. But yes, I, I'm the exact same way whenever I wake up. Yeah. Same way I wake up. You got it, like, it's like never any, though. That's the best part of it. Right. Like, if you've seen something amazing happen today, you're like, yo, God, that was amazing. Thank you. The next day, it's the same. Something thing. horrible happens, and then or, you or, still got to get thanks. Or it's so. great. Right. Like, or it keeps being great. Or. Like, the, tri the trials just shape your character. It says in the Bible, God puts you through trials so you lack nothing. So when I'm going through something, I'm like, yeah, I'm getting stronger, let's go. What's next? You know what I mean? I love it, every day is amazing, bro. God is great, even him shooting that camera shot was great. Here we go, here they are popping up. Got a few of them from people, but they got so far. Power pups, oh, nice. <laughs> they ain't playing. <laughs> yeah, no, I miss it. Oh, I that's cool. Y'all get shoes or not? No, I just waiting for them to get out. Hi. Yo, thank you so much. Thank you so much, bro. Hey, I just want to say I love what you're saying about religion and spirit. I want to be a pastor, actually. Oh, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's get into it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is I like oversized. This is something you learned. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this is one of our most popular good. designs that we did. Ooh. So, I'll put it on right now. Children, close your eyes. Everybody found some? Y'all find some shoes? Good. Yes, Everybody's shoes is on the phone? Yes, All right, who else is left? What about y'all? I think these are my size. I like new shoes. After I put it on my foot. <laughs> no wonder it didn't smell super new. I was like, yo, what? I'm sorry. No. You delete that part. All right, okay. <laughs> okay, there's a lot going on right now. I just came from the back. There's a variety of everything. So it looks like we got some power puffs, uh, some puffs. Lost and found, customs by Isaiah, reimagines, off white Air Max 90s, um, some fucking triple peaks, some of the navies, looks like another reimagined. There's Panda, another triple pink, Doritos. This is one of my favorite shoes, honestly. I really like this shoe. Uh, what's this one called? Pink Phone. Utoes. What's going on with the Uto? Fucking Melzi. Hell of a fucking variety. More dunks than anything, though. I don't think we've ever had anything like this in our store, though. I'm going to be honest. Like, we've had people come in and spend money, but I don't think we've ever had anybody come in and do this for the people. Ryan's for the people. Well, let's all take a group picture. Oh, yes, Shout out, Ryan. Thank you. Thank you, Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. There you go, baby. You got everybody's shoes. Take a look right here. It's been amazing. One, I know you don't know me personally, but I just want to say, you know, 
God don't make mistakes. You guys came in here for a reason, you know, and I just hope you guys pursue God in everything you do and just keep that going. Don't lose faith. It's gonna be a lot of pressure. Don't fold. You know, I know everybody's been through a lot of pain in their life. Same here. But don't 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 make that get you away from God because God loves you. Things happen in life. That's just what it is. But that should never break your spirit. You guys are here for a reason. You guys are still breathing. Don't matter if you missed out on an opportunity. That opportunity is still going to be there because with God, he makes a way out of no way. And I love you guys. Yes, love. Yes, God bless. I built a whole wall of shoes for the people. This is crazy. I like this. Oh, you suck. I don't even need to touch me, bro. Don't do that. Oh, you got grown men crying on shoes right now, bro. Hell yeah. Ah, shit. Bro, you distract me, bro. Fuck. Oh, that's it. I got to. Remember, God, dude. Boom. Ah, yeah. Ooh, that's the first one. Bro, that's why I lost. Oh, man. Come on, dude. You can't you let me have one? I got you. Oh, shit. You're just spamming, bro. You no, I'm not. I got you that air kick. Give me that. Give me that. I ain't letting this go to round three. If you knew it's over. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yep, oh, don't touch me. I knew you were going to run into some shit. You're an <laughs> idiot. <laughs> <laughs> fuck. I thought you had to play this shit. On my channel, I give out bracelets. So this was the scripture that got me through prison for three years. Oh, wow. So the Lord is my life, my salvation, who should I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life, who shall I be afraid of? And we give them away on our website and I've given away over 3,000 of them, all for free. And so we pay for everything, shipping in cost, all that. It's chaos back there for sure. Look behind me, 17 million at least. But other than that though, in media land, I just wanna tell you guys, thank you guys for all the support. Much obliged. Done. All right, there you go. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, we just dropped about, what was it, around almost $30,000, 27. And just thankful for the opportunity to be able to do this. And I appreciate my guy right here. Brother in Christ. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. And uh, yeah, man, um, excited already to come back one day and do it even better. Yeah, I was telling him that, uh, one, you beat the record for the most spin ever of any episode we've ever done. We've done probably about 100 different celebrities. But you also beat all the boxers we've ever done here, too. Like, Breaking records. Way, 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 way out the park. So yeah, definitely a legendary day. Here. Awesome. We'll remember this day for sure. We finished shopping. Thank you. 
Big love, man. Appreciate you guys, man. Much love. No one's ever done this before. My man came in and cashed out for anybody who was inside the store. He set the bar very, very high for a really cool uh, sneaker shopping episode. It was a pleasure having you, Ryan. Thank you, man. Love we'll definitely see you again. Always. Hey, oh. if somebody talks to that, call me. Hey, I'll come right back. I promise you that. We break records here. Yes, sir. Love, man.